hey guys what's going on it's the hood welcome back to another ranking video i will be going over all team leader skins and will be ranking them from worst to best if you're new please make sure to subscribe it would be really helpful for me and it would mean a lot to me Starting out with the list at the last spot or at the number 8 spot, I placed the Spooky Team Leader skin. I see what they were going for with this skin but I just don't think it's good enough to be 1500 V-Bucks. Also I think the skin is overdone, there are too many colors used and overall they combine to form one of the ugliest skin in the game. If I were to rate it out of 10, I think I would give the skin a 2 as it's neither worth it nor good looking. Moving on to the number 7 spot, I placed the Rose Team Leader skin. I think it's an average skin at best, I just don't understand why it's given legendary rarity. Nothing about the skin seems legendary to me, the skin was available to all of those who bought Save the World, I'm sure you can still get it if you buy Save the World. It came with the Rosewood Axe which is also decent at best, I don't think I use it very often. So overall if I were to rate it out of 10, I think I would give it a 4 out of 10 as it's not the best Save the World exclusive that we could have gotten. Moving on to the number 7 spot, I've placed the Mecha Team Leader skin. I like how detailed the skin is, there's a lot going on with it and I think it suits the skin in this case. The only thing I dislike is the fact that it's way too bulky. Combine that with the fact that it is pink makes it one of the easiest skin to spot in the game which I think ruins one of the styles for me. The skin also comes with the grey version which I think looks better comparatively and has an overall better color scheme to it. It's still not good enough though to make me want to place the skin higher on the list. So if I were to rate it out of 10, I would give it a 5 out of 10 just because of the grey style we just got. Moving on to the number 5 spot, we have the blue team leader skin. I personally really like the color scheme of the blue team leader skin. It looks very clean and simple. It was also the first PS Plus skin we ever got so it's kind of OG as well. And overall, it's a very good skin but again at the end of the day, it's a reskin of the default skin so it lacks creativity and I don't think it deserves to be any higher than this. Out of 10, I think I would give it a 5 as it's not bad and it's not the best either. Moving on to the number 4 spot, I've placed the Guarded Team Leader skin. Probably one of the most overrated legendary skin in the game. I just don't understand why people like this skin. It's literally a pink bear being sold for 2000 V-Bucks. The only good thing about it is the fact that it comes with the Cardinal Bow backbling, which is a somewhat good backbling. You can use it with every skin, but it is barely noticeable, so there isn't a lot special about it. If I were to rate Cardinal Team Leader out of 10, I would give it a 5 as well, only because of its price. I think the price should be 1500 V-Bucks bucks or maybe even lower than that. Moving on to the number 3 spot, I've placed the Clover Team Leader skin. Guys, first of all, just look at the difference between the prices of Cuddle Team Leader and Clover Team Leader. There is barely any difference between the skins and there is a huge difference between their prices which is ridiculous if you ask me. I really like the idea of the skin, the green and white go perfectly well with each other. Overall, it's a very good skin, so if I were to rate it out of 10, I would give it a 7 as it looks decent and it's cheaper in comparison to the others. Coming in at the number 2 spot, we have the Fireworks Team Leader skin. Probably the best July 4th skin you can buy. I think it's one of those skins which you either like a lot or you hate a lot. It's quite a rare skin as well at the moment at least but it will be out soon so if you're interested in buying it, it will be back. It comes with a blasting cap backlink which is pretty bad in my opinion. The only thing that's good about it is the name. So if you decide to buy it, do it for the skin rather than the backlink. I don't think the backlink is worth it at all. If I were to rate it out of 10, I would give it an 8 out of 10 as I really like the color scheme of the skin and I think it stands out just enough. Moving on to the best team leader skin, according to me, we have the Panda team leader skin. Definitely my favorite out of this list, I like how creative the idea of the skin was. An expensive skin but I think it's worth it. If you're going to buy one of the bears, make sure you buy this one as according to me, this is the best one you can get. It comes with a bamboo back bling which is quite good itself, very simple and clean. You can use it with a lot of green colored skins, so basically it complements the skin and makes it even better. If I were to rate it out of 10, I would give it an 8 out of 10 as well. Don't get me wrong, it's a very good skin but I think there are better skins than this. Overall, I think all the team leader skins are really good but there is quite a lot of room for improvement. For example, I think the bear should be provided with an additional variant without the costume. I think that would make the skins a lot better, at least for me. Please note that this was my personal opinion. If you disagree with me, tell me in the comments what your list is. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for more rankings and I'll see you all in a bit.